now, Chief Meteorologist Scott Dorval with the On Your Side forecast. Not too much has changed today. A little smoke and haze around the valley this morning. Temperatures near 100 this afternoon, but we'll drop a few degrees during the day on Thursday. The trend will go up Friday, but we'll drop over the weekend. I think we're going to add some clouds on Saturday and Sunday as well. We'll become partly cloudy. Could even be an isolated storm in the mountains around, say, Sun Valley, the East Central Mountains. But I would cancel plans over it. Back up to 100 and maybe even 101 by Wednesday as another surge of heat heads back in our direction. So it's been cooling off along the coast, which is great. Seattle's in the 90s the other day. Here we are down to 76, Portland at 83. These are the high temperatures from the region. There's your 98 in Boise, 100 in Rome, Oregon, 101 in Mountain Home today, 97 in Twin Falls and Pocatello. It is definitely hot down to the south. And as we look at the fire danger, there's your red flag warning, but our hourly fire danger throughout the day, you see some of the yellow showing up, some moderate uh, numbers here from the hot temperatures, of course, during the afternoon. Of course, there are scattered fires around the region. I'm going to show you those. At least I'll let you know where they're located here, uh, primarily in central Idaho, south of McCall. Watch the smoke showing up on our tower cam here. And right there, that is smoke actually flying through the air. It's high up, so not affecting beautiful visibility down low. Amazing weather in McCall. A little breeze on the lake today. It's 86 degrees right now. Not bad at all. And for the weekend, 85 on Friday, partly cloudy on Saturday and 82, and then 83 with partly cloudy skies on Sunday as well. In the Haley area right now, it is 91 degrees right here at the airport. It's 91. This is where the weather station is located right at the airport. Blue skies. You don't really see any smoke in the air. Good visibility. So if you've got plans for the weekend, should be another great weekend for camping and all uh, outdoor activities looking pretty good. It will be hot, but it will be a little less hot than it's been. 88 on Friday. Now on Saturday, I've got clouds and sunshine and the charts are showing a slight chance of some isolated mountain showers popping up later the day. It would be nothing major, but we cool things down into the mid 80s. That's some nice looking weather and most of our clouds and storms now and a little bit of lightning is in Montana. Uh, that is it. We're dry across the west, but we just have those heat advisories to the south and red flag warnings to the northwest and east. These are your high fire danger areas and the places where fires could, if they develop, would spread rapidly. We had those fires develop right across this region here, across southwest Idaho, Waihee County, and north of Twin Falls. A lot of smoke being produced by those fires and one uh, not far to the west of Warm Lake. Here's the future cast through Thursday. You don't see much cloud cover. By Friday afternoon, we have sunshine, patchy smoke, and there could be a few clouds later the day coming to the north. But the chart show on Saturday, you see the cloud cover building a little bit here. Not a tremendous amount for the Treasure Valley north and west, but this line again of some of that monsoon moisture trying to make its way to the north. So this could produce some dry lightning strikes down to the higher terrain of the Magic Valley and also north and east of Sun Valley around Bora Peak as well. So we'll have to keep an eye on that for Saturday night. So be careful if you are out there Saturday night into Sunday. My exclusive true view of tomorrow's weather today showing those blue skies and not 100 degrees, but close 99 in Vail, 97 in Weezer, 98 Ontario, 96 in Boise. Caldwell, you should hit 96 as well. Sunshine, that afternoon wind could kick up to 15, maybe gusting as high as 25. Areas of smoke in the Boise Mountains. Again, this is in the morning. It should be similar to today, maybe even a little less smoke. 80s in Long Valley and 80s in Stanley and Sun Valley as well. About 90 degrees in the Fairfield area. My extended forecast bringing that temperature drop down to 94 by Sunday with a chance for a little cloud cover coming in and high temperatures at 100 or better on Tuesday and Wednesday of next uh. week. Look at that 101. That's the first one I, I've had up there. You increased that. Yeah, I did. It's 5 o'clock. I noticed. Just, the charts just keep coming in kind of hot and they've been trending cooler and not being that hot right. when we right. finally get to that day. Let's hope that's the case again. But boy, it's showing real what, hot. What's beyond that, I'm afraid to ask. It's August. It's just hot. <laughs> <laughs> it's August. Thanks, Scott.